Hey guys, welcome to another weekly vlog. I just wanted to jump on real quick and do a intro to start off the week. I just figured let me get that part out of the way. <laughs> so welcome to another vlog. My name is uh. So welcome to another vlog. My name is Shamoy. If this is your first time here, hope you'll stick around to see what I do all this week. I'm your girl who have no plans for the week, but have a lot to do at the same time. So we'll see. Let's see what's on this week's agenda. So today is still July 4th. So happy 4th. I hope you guys had an amazing holiday time with the family and friends, fireworks, all the good stuff. I just got off of work <laughs> and I don't feel like doing anything else for the day. So, um, yeah, I just got off work. Work wasn't too bad today. We actually had fun because we were trying to do a bingo. <laughs> we had a bingo card or a couple bingo cards. And at first, none of the bingo was bingoing. <laughs> we were not getting the crazy calls that we thought we were going to get. So we ended up like making a few more um bingo cards for like the last four hours of our shift still didn't bingo but it did make our day go by faster knowing that we're working the holiday and you know how people are on the phone so but it wasn't terrible we made the best of it we had fun doing it and glad it's over and now i'm off the next four days so let's talk about what i have going on this week this vlog i'm hoping won't be too long i'm hoping i will get it done in a reasonable time and without making it excessive don't worry about me i'm just trying to find decent lighting um so what's on my agenda this week so tomorrow i want to get up do my usual morning routine got the gym i do have a little like storage container to put together for my office i will show you guys that whenever i do it it's just from walmart i needed another organizer for the closet in my office slash spare bedroom because i feel like the closet has gotten out of hand and i want to declutter am i the only one that feels like whenever i know i have to do like a deep cleaning or something like that i have to start from like one side of the house there's no way for me to just clean one little section i just literally have to start on one side of the house hold on so this vlog i kind of want to do slightly different because i'm going to be shooting probably three content in one so i'm doing the weekly vlog but i also want to do a clean with me because i need to give one good cleaning i don't want to make the cleaning video too long i mean you guys know how to clean <laughs> so that is not what that is but i just feel like it would be fun if i turn on the camera while i clean so i've been telling you guys i want to do one more deep cleaning and what i mean deep clean i mean just kind of touch everything so right now i'm in the guest bathroom for the most part i told you guys i don't use this bathroom but i did clean the tub a couple weeks back and nobody uses the tub but i have a guest coming very very soon next week some of you already know so i need to freshen up this bathroom i want to hit this baseboard the two little baseboards that you can see <laughs> i need to add a couple decor up there and i need to get a shower head so we need to do that this week so i might go to home depot or walmart and see if i find a shower head shower curtain is fine that's fine i need to make the counter look a little better i need to do the drawers right here make sure she has everything she needs i did pick up a couple things from walmart but i want you guys to see that in the other video so i'm gonna do a guest bathroom refresh slash getting ready for your guests so i did pick up a couple like travel size and essential from walmart and i do need to hit up target one more time and get a couple things but i feel like i need to make a list because whenever you're trying to do things without a list it just never works so that's the goal this week is to make a list for the store mike comes back on saturday after being gone a whole month so i have to pick him up so once i pick him up i'll get a couple things in vegas need a deep clean so i'm going to be filming a clean with me and i'm also going to be filming the guest bathroom situation and that those are the two main things that i need to do and then i need to film some other little mini content but nothing too crazy 
So I'll tell you guys what I'm doing, but I probably won't show you every single step that I'm doing because it's going to be in other videos. So I don't want to double everything because if I show you guys these right now, you're going to see it again when I put the bathroom together. But I'll make a list of everything I need and I will take you guys through that process tomorrow. But I think tonight I'm going to work on my to-do list, plan out everything I need to do over the next three days have everything planned that way I can knock everything out without taking up too much time so just wanted to do a quick intro check in with you guys get ready for the days off content again I will check back in once I'm putting together that little cube thing I bought from Walmart I might do that first thing in the morning after my devotional and everything and yeah so see you guys soon <laughs> So I'll check back in with you guys at some point. guys it's the next day today is Wednesday Wednesday July 5th it's Mike's birthday so help me wish mr. Mikey Mike a happy birthday by the time you guys see this it's a week later but still leave some comment down below wishing him a happy birthday those of you that don't know I'm married to a cancer <laughs> He's not here, unfortunately, which is a little bummer, but it's okay. He'll be back in a few days. We'll celebrate. We'll do something. So that's that. So post gym smoothie. Um, this is the berry mix, which is a little bit grainy. It's like all you feel is grainy. This is why people don't eat healthy because, dude, it looks so good and it tastes delicious. But I just cannot wait. Every two seconds, I'm like, <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Oh my God. Like, how? Tell me. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. I think those greens are from the raspberry. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I'm going to go sip on this. I'm actually going to start working on my little project that I'm doing. So let's get over there. I forgot to close that cabinet. I look like it might now. <laughs> it is so dark in my office. Let me open the, let me open the blinds. All right, you guys, welcome to, back to my office. It's been a minute since I've really been in here, like work in here, but we're going to get it together. Um, it's not bad, actually, because I, um, I did spring clean in here weeks ago when I did, weeks ago, <laughs> not going to get into because I don't remember when, but I did, you know, vacuum, um, put everything away a couple weeks ago. 
but I need to do a little bit more decluttering but for the most part it's not bad I have my I moved my bike in here because I feel like I can still open the window and work out in here the only thing is I don't have a TV in here but that's fine it's fine it's no big deal I can always grab my tablet or my phone and sit it up and still watch something if I wanted to but most time if I'm doing like exercise I'm gonna do music I'm not the type of person to like read a book or watch a movie while I work out because I need that motivation either the music or I need a guided workout so that's there but the thing I want to get together is the closet um, let me I'm trying to see where to move everything right now also when I was decluttering the pills and stuff, the vitamin and stuff you guys saw me organize in the last vlog. I took out all of my IVF medication and I'm kind of sorting them. So I have like boxes everywhere because I'm going through them and seeing what's expired to be destroyed and medication that I still have that is still good. So, um, I, for example, I have these enoxaparin. <laughs> sodium injections and they're not expired they're good to like make sure i can't even tell what that date is but either way they're not expired so i'm like going through what i need to throw away what i need to give away if you're on here and you've done ivf let me know down below what i should do with these medication and yeah i probably could email my clinic to see what I can do with that but I kind of want to get rid of them whether throwing away donate because I don't know when I'm gonna do another one or if I'm gonna if I'm gonna ever do another one so yeah I kind of want to declutter because I feel like they're taking up so much space they were taking up all that space right there where I have my vitamins and stuff which is now my new like little medicine first aid section and I got more underneath the guest bathroom ca um, cabinet so I kind of want to take everything out from down there which is what prompt me to kind of go through everything so I can decide what I'm doing and then I have my yoga mat over here because if I want to do yoga at home this is where I come and do it so I just have the mat and the two blocks and then everything else is just my filming equipment which is a little bit bulky I have this tripod <laughs> which I haven't really used again I have not really sat in here and film in a while but I kind of want to get back to it I'm ready to get back to sit down videos you guys know I've just been vlogging 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 showing you guys what I'm doing every weekend but I want to get back to a couple of favorites and empties and all those little things that I like to film so this is my big camera, which is my um, Canon 80D. And I have three, because when I first started YouTube, I knew, I knew, <laughs> when I first started YouTube, I knew I needed lighting. And the first thing that everybody was using was soft boxes. So I have two soft boxes, and I feel like they take up so much space. So I try to keep them to the side like to one side yeah I try to keep them to one side over here by the window I don't know if you guys can see it cameras soft boxes and stuff um, to the side just to kind of take up less space that way over here is kind of empty so bike I have a box here with the expired uh, medication that I need to finish going through and some of these I don't even know what to do with them this is just like a extra I think I had a light on it or something but I can't even close it all the way I think that's as far as it goes so this closet here has my weights which I haven't really been wearing because my style has changed a little bit. So some of those wigs I wear, but some of it is just like, mm, 
<laughs> so what I have in this closet is luggage. We keep our luggages in here. I have the wigs, braiding hair, hair, different type of hair for my hair, and some like filming equipment and stuff. So it's getting a little bit cluttered, which is why I bought a cube organizer so that's what i'm about to put together i'm not going to film the whole process because you guys know how it is building things <laughs> trying to build things on my own because i'm so used to just having mike put together different you know stuff but that's what we're about to do so that's why i'm making a little bit of space in here so that i can put it together so let me do a before of the closet real quick. So I have this clothing rack here for whenever I do try on hauls because Mike was using this, but he finally like cleared it up. So I took it. I think it fits really good right here. It fits right there on that wall and the bike. I wanted it to kind of face the sun so that if I'm riding it, the window is right there. So that is that. But let me move this because I feel like, yeah. So this is the before of the closet. As you can see, my wigs are going to stay. <laughs> the wigs are going to stay. Um, I'll just slide them down a little bit. See, just like that, you clear up space. And then this was one of those um, shoe organizers. But I don't know what I want to put in there. So I need to go through it. And just kind of decide what fits better in here. Just things I need to see and reach. More hair. <laughs> More hair. And that's where the luggages were in that corner. But Mike has some of them right now. And I have like a printer that no longer works. Um, some skincare products that I haven't used. So this is the section here. That all need to come out. And reorganize. So, we need to take care of this. So, I figured I'll get one of these cube organizers from Walmart. This, was, this one was only like, was it $49? It was somewhere, yeah, it was like $49. It wasn't expensive at all. Let me lay it down. Uh, one more. Work on it right there. So this is the one I got. Again, I think it was like $47. I don't think the price is on here. And I got the I got four of the little baskets that goes in there so that I can organize everything that I have and just make it look better. Um and I also like that you can put it either standing like what is this? 12 3 6 9 9 9 cubes. But I think you can put it two ways. I thought I saw a picture with two ways. Yeah, they have the... So another reason I like these um, packing cubes, which I have a smaller one. I have a six piece in my laundry room, which is where I keep all my hair products. Um, if you've been here long enough, you saw when I organized or you've seen my hair products in previous video. But I'll show you guys a clip at some point. Um, but what I like about these cubes is that they're very universal. So even though I'm using this room as my office right now, let's say a baby was to come in the mix, <laughs> this can be just transformed into just that. And I also love that you can choose, you can still make it like decorative and put as many of these baskets as you want to put in there for the storage. So if I wanted only three baskets, I can make the other six look cute. So that's another reason I like these. So I figured it's multi-purpose. So even though I'm using it right now just for my content stuff, later on I can use it in any room, in any space to make it, you know. So it's not a waste, basically. So I'm going to get my tools together. That's enough rambling for me today. I said I wasn't going to talk as much in these videos. 
yeah <laughs> so that's it for right now i'm gonna get my phone i'm gonna get music and i'm gonna put this together so i'll show you guys what's in the box the pieces and show you all of it together <laughs> so i'll be back <laughs> That's that most city that's I that you can't go around at night. You like to get me out of You know what no one inside you. You like when I make fire, you say you fake and make you fire. Let me come inside you, let me plant that seed inside you. That's the tits, tits, only thing that's the whip. Only thing that was real, only thing I can feel. So why you bother me? Why you bother me? Why you bother me? Trying to catch me. We did it. Oh, not the camera turning. <laughs> camera said, uh, no. But I did it. I don't know if I did this hanging part right. I think I did. It feels secure, except that it moves a little bit. So I probably will let Mike check it, but I'm not going to really put anything heavy. It's exactly what I wanted. I could have went for 12 storage bins. I left this little gap here because I might put like this little equipment bag back here you see that yeah so I left that little gap so I can hide a couple things there and then on this side the luggages will continue to be there um, I don't know they should all fit if we stack them on top of each other right now I have one luggage because I brought the other one so we gotta do that but yeah this is it um, let me show you guys the little I bought the little, little baskets to go in there. Little storage basket. Uh, let me set you guys up. Probably a little dark in here. Facing this way. Ooh, yeah, very dark. Ooh. I why this took me like forever. Literally like four hours. Probably more. I mean I did stop once or twice. I'll try to find a spot to see you guys. Why am I stressing when I can just extend the tripod? Ooh. All right. So yeah, I don't know why this took me forever, but it's okay. I put my time, I got it done. I have a bunch of stuff here to go through, which I don't think I'm gonna go through right this very second. But I wanna at least put these little storage bin in. Um, Oh no, it's only one. I thought this comes with two in the pack. Ugh. That's a bummer. I thought it comes with two in each pack. And that way I bought four, but maybe not. So this is the little storage bin. I went with black because it was like, at least I have some dark black accents in here. So I was like, okay, so let me go in with gray or white. I'll just go with black, so let me lower you guys down a little bit. So, since I only have two of these now, 
I'm gonna have to go back and get some more. But let's just do this one and this one. And the packaging, because I was looking at it this way and I was like, oh, it looks like it's two in there. Nope. And I think these were like $5 a piece. I don't remember. So, definitely need a couple more. I think I want to get, I think I want to get like four or five. Because I do have quite, quite a amount of stuff. But for now, that is what it looks like with two. That is what it looks like. So, yeah, have some space in the corner to put a couple things. And that way I can grab the things I need the most quickly. So, I want to keep it like... Um, maybe I should have put the hair stuff over there. No, I want to keep like hair supplies in one for when I do my hair. Like braids <laughs> type of hair. I want to keep um, camera equipment in one of them. So yeah, um, I don't really feel like going through it right now. So let me put the luggage back. Perfect. And uh, what else I can put in that corner? Like that extra tripod I was telling you guys about. I can... that all right so that's that and I have this other bag of stuff I don't think it fit not the not me knocking everything down okay that actually fits back there and give a little bit of support and anything that can like tripod, <laughs> any tripod type stuff, I can probably lean these over there. Okay, work out perfect. Now I just have to go through everything I have and organize. These, I actually forgot I had these black ones. These are just poster boards for photography. And I think there's a little bit of like gap behind this thing. So I can still see it, but it's hidden. Perfect! We're making progress. <laughs> Love that for me. Love that for me. But yeah. I have a mess. <laughs> I have a mess down here that I have to go through. I have a box of skincare, my hair products. But yeah, I'm going to wait till tomorrow. Tomorrow I'll go grab the extra baskets that I need because I'm going to need all of them. But I'm going to declutter a lot. <laughs> I'm going to declutter a lot and get rid of a lot of stuff that I have here. Like Some stuff are just like empty boxes that I keep. For example, if I buy headphones, I keep the box. Buy a new mouse, I keep the box. So now that I've had my mouse for like two, three months, I can throw away the box. Like, it's no big deal. So I just have to kind of see what I have, sort it, and organize it. Like my laptop bag, all that stuff keeps in here. Um... For decorative purposes, what I was saying was, bring you guys back a little bit. Like, if I don't fill up. <laughs> All right, real quick, real quick. What I was trying to say was, if I don't fill up all the cubes, I can also use some as decoration. So, like my headphone box, I can put right there. I can put what else I had saw that looked cute. <laughs> The headphone box, maybe this little box here, because I still have a couple things in here. I don't even know. Oh, did they give me extra sticky? Please tell me you gave me extra sticky. 
They did. Oh my God. This is why. Oh. Well, anyway, that's what I was talking about with the decoration where you can fill some of the gaps with decorative pieces. But. Oh. <laughs> I have to say this real quick. I have this wide angle lens that go on the camera that you guys are on right now. And it came with like a command strip to put it on. Well, after so long and the sun and everything, it came apart. So I haven't used this in months. So I sh like I was telling you, I opened, the, I opened the box. Tell me why I got a whole thing of extra strips. Like I was Googling, I was on Amazon searching for these. I even messaged the seller and I don't think they understood what I was asking for, but I was like, hey, is there any way to get more of these? And I, like I said, I don't think they understood what I was saying. Tell me why there's four more in here. And then a little cleaner for the lens, the manual. Oh, that's what I have in here is the cup lens cover this is why i don't throw away my box oh for months this lens is just sitting here what that lens do is give you it's just like it says wide angle lens oh oh let me rip one off right now so when i go on the other side of the house because the lens is in my bathroom look at this and now i can also see the name to maybe Google it and see if I find a set of it. <laughs> that is hilarious. So yeah, that is what I'll do. Any extra um, square, I'll put some decorative pieces in there. I can put a candle in there just to make it look cute. And then the basket, I'm over here talking to the wall. <laughs> and then the baskets will keep everything else concealed. And I think I'm going to use my label maker and put a couple labels on there. So just put like camera equipment, hair supplies, um, anything. So that way, when I get up to look for something, I can just reach for it. Everything needs a place. That's the biggest thing with organizing. Everything needs a place. And it makes your job so much easier. Don't worry, I'm going to be decluttering up there as well. It's pretty decluttered. Um, I have hair rollers in that white container. That is just a wig box. I have a couple miscellaneous things that I need to go through over there. iPad box. So again, boxes that I keep, I just kind of throw them in here. I have extra hangers up there for the wigs. I might give my mom a few just to get rid of some of them because I don't even remember how many came in the pack. I'm not going to have that many wigs, <laughs> but I'm glad I did this today because also I'm going to go to Ross to find baskets for the coat closet because I need to organize the shelf up there as well because I want the coat closet to be like a storage closet. So extra light bulbs, extra um, like wrapping paper is in there um, for like Christmas time and all that. Um, so I want to organize that one as well. So now that I've opened this up a little bit, I know that I need a couple baskets. I might try to find like a dark color like this wall just to tie it all in. And then I, I need to measure the length of both of them. So I have an idea of how many um, b b b baskets I need to get to just make it look nice and full. They will be labeled. So, oh, so excited. I get excited about organizing, guys. So stay with me, okay? So I think that's it for my Wednesday. That is it for my Wednesday. My food is already here. I need to go eat, relax, because I really haven't sat down watching the TV or anything like that. Um, so I'm going to eat and relax. And if I'm in the mood later, I might come <coughs> and sort some of this a little bit too. And then tomorrow I'll continue. I'll measure everything because I want to have everything done, measured and everything by Saturday. So when I go to Vegas, I know what I'm getting. So, oh, thank you guys for hanging with me. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Good morning, guys. I forgot to do a little get ready with me this point because I was rushing to get out of there. But say what? 
excuse. Look who decided to show up. Ain't no excuse. Look who decides to come back excuse. home. We giving them wrong excuses. You got something to say? You heard me. I ain't hear you. Okay. Well, somebody said they didn't want to get to the airport. I have to wait. So, there's that. Yeah. I didn't want her to wait for me. Well, I did want her to wait for me, but she showed up late. <laughs> I did not show up late. I got there and he was like, oh, I'm still waiting on my luggage. Oh, well, you told me to get here, so here I am. Here I am. So we went to breakfast at another Keatley spot. I cannot pronounce it. Bol... Bol de Gis? <laughs> uh, I thought it was Bulldoggies. Probably Bulldoggies. That made more sense. That's what it sounded like to me. <laughs> But Doggy. I'll insert a picture of the food, the little picture I took. It was good. There was a lot of eggs. Way too many. A lot of eggs, but it was so good. So I'm about to run into Target to get a couple more minis for the it's funny cause, uh, guest room. She goes, I, I need to go to Target, but I don't know what I need to get. I was supposed to make a list, but what, what happened was... What? I got so busy. I was supposed to. Who comes to Target and just like just fly it? Like you don't even go to Walmart and do that. I do. <laughs> I did that last week. I walk all through there. I end up with three body wash. <laughs> like who needs three body wash? The girl at the counter, she was like, um, "Which one of those smell? Or which one of those is good?" I'm like, "Shoot, I got three of them. I say all of them good." <laughs> I told her, I said, I don't even know how I ended up with three. I said, I went for a daytime and a nighttime body wash. My eucalyptus one that I like, the eucalyptus and, no, eucalyptus or lavender. Lavender and chamomile, chamomile. So, that's my nighttime one. And then I was like, okay, I'm going to pick a daytime one because I'm running out. And I saw one. I was like, okay, cool. This one, I think a girl had sent it to me. One of my friends had sent it to me. And she was like, next time, try this one. So I was like, okay. I finally saw it and picked it up. Then I saw one that says summer. I think it says summer care or something along those lines. And it said um, limited edition. Which means it ain't going to be there if I don't get it now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I picked it up too. And she was like, yeah, that one says limited edition. I said, that's exactly why I picked it up. Because I could not pass it up. It smells good and it's limited edition. So now I have two summer body wash. For the, but I'm good for at least three months. <laughs> I'm good for like three months. But yeah, I was supposed to like shop my bathroom first. And see like what little extra stuff I have in my um, cabinets. That way I don't put all that. But I have a pretty good idea. I need more toothpaste. I'm going to get a couple mouthwash, the little minis. Because we went from having one visitor to having three maybe so i'm trying to make sure to just have toothbrush i already have a lot of toothpaste at the house um i have a couple soap bars um so that part should be good but i'll see what they have and then that's pretty much it the cotton rounds and flosses i think i have enough flosses and lotion yeah need lotion so just those things i'm just going to think about it from like head to toe what you need to wash your face your body and moisturize and then you have your essential like um swabs and stuff like that that way bathroom essentials so that's what i'm going for and then i told you guys i was doing the basket like a guest basket so i want to put things in there that she need i already bought her a water bottle i think i showed you guys i don't remember if not i'll show it again but i got her a water bottle that she can use at home and take on the road when we go out and then I want to get her some house slippers, maybe a little robe or something she can put on, or maybe I'll give her one of mine. I don't know yet, but yeah. Mike is going to help me in Target. <laughs> He's like, what? My budget is 100 bucks, so you got to keep me on track. There's only two items. Damn. At Target. No, it ain't. Yeah, that, it that's is. the four it is. Target, that's two Target? items right nah. there. Nah, I'm, that's why I said minis. I'm getting minis and I might get a full size lotion. Or body butter or something. Yeah. That's pretty much it. Mm -hmm. So you ready? I guess. You have a choice?
to sarcasm for me. Do I have a choice? You always have a choice. <laughs> you can stay in the car or you can come along. <laughs> Going to Sam's. I'm walking lazily. <laughs> lazily walking. He gonna park far and then tell me, oh, this is a long walk. Did you park far? Well, we're off to a good start. No, we're not. <laughs> On the rug. Remember that rug I've been trying to find? Yep. I just found a washable one. <laughs> For 99 bucks. $99. So I'm putting Mike to work as soon as we get to the house. Just landed. <laughs> You've been on vacation. <laughs> Was Which one we've we been getting lately? Isn't it That's our original choice, but I don't think we've been getting it. 22, 28, 25. Was this one? No, I don't remember. Hold on. It's fine, just pick that. <laughs> but this one's cheaper. Ooh. What is this? <laughs> what You'll is see the name? Quilted? Then? That's the name, Quilted. What is that? It's like paper? when you told me old oh, Target has their own name brand. Target does not have a name brand. They carry their own brands. I ain't getting no quilted. Okay, we'll, we'll stick Charmin. with Charmin. I've been using Charmin for ever. Yeah, we know and you and your four sheets. Really good, okay? You and your four sheets. <laughs> Why are you putting my information on there? <laughs> 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 That's funny. They've been well counted. Okay. <laughs> All I gotta say. I mean, nothing wrong if you gotta make it six. No. There you know. Is. That's, way too much. That's it. Oh, we were gonna check out the juice. Every sheet is uh, necessary. <laughs> so. Hey guys, I have not vlogged or picked you guys up in like three days, <laughs> four days. And I need to clean this lens because it is dirty. But anyway, I just got a PR package. We're going to call it PR even though it's free for Pattern Beauty because they had products that were like um, unreleased free products. I thought I was getting one for July and one for August. Look at the box. Look at this box. This is their leave-in conditioner, which I think is the one. No, I, I think I have this already. I think I purchased this. I have oh, their heavy conditioner, which I already have because they sent it to me last time. So I think they send us some like minis to try, but I already have that one. Their gel, which I have yet to try. So this is their curl gel. <laughs> their shampoo, which I don't remember if this is the same shampoo I have because they have more than one. This is their hydrating shampoo, which I think is the one I have, but I got to double check. I think this is actually the new product. I got to look up their stuff, but this is their moisture milk and I think it's new. It's just like, I don't know, it's a uh, full size and it's kind of taped up. They sent me a brush, which I've been wanting to get. I was like, I need to get their stuff. Their stuff just looks so good. Like it, it's made by somebody with natural hair. So I respect that. Sent me their brush, which I don't think is new. This is their mousse, which they came out with. I haven't tried. This is their Scalp Detox. Haven't tried. <laughs> oh my God. Send me all this for free? There's, oh, thank God I didn't buy any of this stuff. There's serum. I gotta change the battery. <laughs> ah! And last but not least, I think this is their oil. I gotta take it out of the tape. Rip me out of the tape. Got me feeling brand new for whatever TikToks is. Come through a pattern beauty.